G'day and hi there everyone, it is Mimo here and back for another huge helper rewards opening. Now a bit bigger than the last one I'd done with the 1312 tokens here, which 13 in there, quality number, hopefully it should bring me some luck, it has done well throughout my life so let's kick it in the place right here. Basically got up for grabs a trio of three stars which includes Timothy as you see here, also Craig and the second or the third one swinging around here is Diego so those trios are basically what you're going to get and with the quantity of tokens I've got here I'm guaranteed to get a fair few of them in my roster which isn't overly that bad because you've got a fair few options in which you can use them for and basically you can sell them straight into your supply depot and get those extra supply points or if you're in a level up tournament like I am right now, you can actually use them to level up. Uh, whether it be through getting your renown points through either the rush objective, so you feed each character into themselves and get their rushes up and get those sort of objectives, or just getting the other objectives, whether it be persona or trade objectives, it can definitely get you some extra points because being a rare, they are cost effective in regards to the food and things like that when you are putting plays into them which in some cases I actually put common plays which are the one star plays into them to actually just get certain objectives because it is so cost friendly and things like that but I'm not gonna lie you're gonna get a solid amount of absolutely crap you know one star weapons and common weapons and one star characters like you see there you are gonna get a amount of crap but you are gonna get some quality too with the three star characters and also some three star weapons and things like that so you know good with the bad but it will come in handy especially if you're in a level up you don't necessarily have to use it in a level up but you will clog up your roster so it is much better to use it in a level up and that is one of the reasons why I haunt them is to use them in a level up just because like I said it's giving you more options you know if you use this in tandem with also your elite items and things like that and your basic tokens you're gonna really fill your roster up and like sort of fulfill your objectives with those characters and it's going to allow you a lot of options without having to spend money to sort of keep up with plays and things like that but like you see plenty of Timu coming out so Timothy plenty of Craig's coming out and there's plenty of Diego so those three stars are on a roll which is why I call this the rare I guess character chase and like I said you got those three up for grabs and you will end up with quite a few of them which is helpful throughout a level up tournament or is helpful for helpful it is helpful for your supply point counts getting a bit tongue-tied there but yeah plenty of stuff coming up and it gets a really I guess I I don't know when it comes to the level up tournament just because I save so much tokens of helper rewards elite item tokens basic tokens I fair think can spend about five hours just opening these things before I even get into the level up just and I clog my roster up I think I'll show you in the level up video when I do put it together just the amount of stuff I'm going to end up in my roster. I don't even want to look at it after these. So, like after I do all the openings, every time I look at it, I'm like, whoa, whoa, and whoa, because you just end up with a really, really huge roster count way beyond. There's a three-star meat cleaver. Like I said, three-star weapons, not bad, which you can even dissemble. I don't think really... I don't know any too many people that actually use three-star weapons to upgrade, but, you, you know, I guess some of them have some quality. It just allows you not as many upgrades as a four-star. I definitely dissemble my three-star weapons. Hopefully get some quality parts for the four-star ones, which is always nice. Getting down to the end here, this has been a whole lot of openings. A whole lot. Don't... I, re I really hate when you get common weapons. Really, there's another Craig. I think I actually, there's Timothy too, not a bad run there. I think I get a lot more Craigs than the other two. Like, Craig seems to pop up a lot more than Timothy and Diego. Like, I get a heap of Timothy and Diego, speaking of Diego, there he is. But I seem to get a lot more, I see a lot more of that. I don't know if it's the orange jumpsuit that catches my eye. There he is. I seem to get a lot more of that guy in the orange jumpsuit, which is the Craig. Uh, he just seems to pop up a lot more frequently than the other two. There he is again. So um, I'm not exactly eating my words there because uh, he keeps popping up. There's Timothy. So getting the, getting pretty lucky here. This is the last four openings. Got a fair few of them as I thought I would, which is pretty nice. Like I said, plenty of options with those three stars. And it's always better than getting a common like that, Olivia there. Neil and the lucky last opening. Oh, that was Neil. I thought there was one more. I missed the other two. So that is that done and dusted. As always, hope you did enjoy it. Thanks for watching.